the first major snowstorm of the season is marching east and packing a punch. Several U.S. cities are getting hit with heavy snow, the storm leaving behind chaos on its way to Atlantic Canada. In Nova Scotia, there's this thing with the weather. It's unpredictable. Environment Canada issued a special weather statement ahead of the storm's arrival on Sunday. Southern Nova Scotia could see up to 25 centimeters of snow with 15 centimeters possible in western Halifax. We typically apply salt and brine ahead of a weather event like this one. And then uh, once the snow starts falling, crews will be out uh, clearing snow as quickly as possible. The timeline of what we're watching, especially along the south shore of Nova Scotia, it'll pick up as early as the morning hours on Sunday, intensifying for the afternoon and evening. 15 and up to 25 centimeters is possible, and the winds, the big weather story and concern, up to 70 kilometers per hour, we're looking at blowing snow across the region. And while the snow is a welcome sight for local businesses that thrive on stormy weather. The snow we get, it'll boost sales, and we'll see people coming in the door and going to the hills. The conditions are unwelcome for some living rough this winter. I wouldn't want my roof to collapse on me again. I didn't like waking up that way. It wasn't fun. Emergency shelters are being set up in Halifax, Dartmouth and Lower Sackville. Officials say Halifax Ground Search and Rescue will also be conducting wellness checks to several homeless encampments. Environment Canada says these types of storms can cause dangerous driving conditions, school closures and of course power outages. As such, the city says residents play an important role in keeping obstacles off the sidewalks so operators can do their jobs as quickly as possible. Vanessa Wright, Global News, Halifax.